Match number one. Parker Bone the third, Mika Koivuniemi. Parker gets off to a great start. The front eight. Complete control in that first match. He snaps Mika off, 278, 246. Then in match number two, the hometown favorite feast. He faces off against the Beast. And it was all West Malat. Malat starts with the front six, finishes strong, and beats Parker Bone the third, 255, 248. And then in match number three, it was all about staying alive. Lanes go through transition, players making moves, changes, ball changes. Wes Malat, a little luck on his side, trips the two forward for a four bagger. Wes Malat outlasts Stuart Williams, 202 to 185. Wes Malat will now take on. You know, those numbers don't lie and they don't go away. Runner up finishes twice. And majors. A lot opening up with a mix a lot. To their bowling center here. Almost opening his championship match against West Malat. Right. We'll learn here on tour. One pin stacked behind another. Uh oh. He got it. Two handed style and delivery of the most powerful man on the tour. Jason solves that left lane early. Yet won a major in their career. Ten pin. Ten. So he has to get his hand around the side of the bowling ball more to get it to finish harder in the back part of the lane. Spare. That's a better shot. That's better a result. better result. Belmo working on a strike. And he doubles up. Fifth year on tour. It's somewhere close to the 80% range. Which has made him the scoring average leader so far in the season. As many, the left lane has been the trouble lane. Left lane trouble, no more. Right now, it's like, hey, Belmo, let's go. So a triple from a lot. Belmo working on a three back of his own. Can he get the catch? No. Is he's really good at throwing it slower. down doing the right thing uh, again doesn't get that mess a very good bowler John Janowitz is a great player Barnes finishes 14th trying to come up grand slam winner on tour Patrick Allen 60 he does like this house as we mentioned led the US Open before PDW won his fourth US Open in this building back in 07 and Malak coming. And you just got done saying how that was so he could get his thumb out of the ball. Opponent <laughs> starts slow playing you. I mean, that can affect rhythm. A lot of things to affect rhythm during a TV finals. Track the entire way. Como on the approach of the left lane right now. Working on a strike. A double for Belmo in search of his first major title. Malat will finish on that right lane, as you said. And here Malat on the right lane with the strike. Ninth frame for Wes Malat. Can he bring the strike? Yes, he can! Now, Westmont will wait. What will Belmo bring to the right side? He brings them all down, is what he does. Championship. To keep the heat on, Jason Belmonte. Yeah, that's perfect. In his face. That was a key ball for him, that first of three here in the 10th. 
Can he strike again? Can he get the kick? Yes, he does! That is the Belmonte pin carry. This is what the two-handed style can do for you in terms of pin carry. Watch the head pin come off the sidewall and just disintegrate the 10. Remember, he can't shut out West Force West Milan to go to the wall in his 10th. And he does it! Belmo does what he needed to do to give himself the best chance. He needs to strike on every ball. And he gets it! Oh! The last minute! Same moment here. Malat has to strike out. That will not do it. Wes Malat comes up short. A disconsolate Wes Malat takes his leave. Jason Belmonte takes his trophy. Better add his name to the top of the list for player of the year as well with Scott Norton. The best company in the world. Belmo has finally done it, home. and we will hear from our newest oh, major champion when we come back.